Step 1. Prep the backboard number 9 by inserting the cam locks D into each cam hole ensuring the arrow on the cam lock is facing the entry hole for the cam screw. Step 2. Prep the left end numbered 7 and right end numbered 8 by inserting the cam locks D into each cam hole ensuring the arrow on the cam lock is facing the entry hole for the cam screw. Then screw in the cam screw C into the holes directed clockwise with a screwdriver. Step 3. Separate the bearing runners E by extending the runner and pushing the clip down as shown. Then attach the larger outer part of the left end 7 and right end 8 by screwing in the 6x16 screws B clockwise with a screwdriver, ensuring the front end of the runner is flush with the edge of the ends. Step 4. Attach the left end 7 and right end 8 to the backboard 9 by locking the cam screw C into the cam locks D clockwise with a screwdriver. Then insert the wooden dials H into the top of the ends 7 and 8 as shown. Step 5. Prep the top numbered 6 by screwing in the cam screw C clockwise with a screwdriver. Step 6. Attach the top 6 to the left end 7 and right end 8 by locking the cam screw C into the cam locks D clockwise with a screwdriver. Step 7. Insert the wooden dials H into the bottoms of the ends 7 and 8 as shown. Then attach the base number 10 to the end 7 and 8 by screwing the direct screws K through the base and into the ends clockwise using the Allen key. Step 8. Prep the plinths number 12 by inserting the cross styles J into the holes in the plinths ensuring that the hole in the cross style aligns with the hole at the end of the plinth. Step 9. Connect the plinths 12 to the feet numbered 11 by screwing the furniture screws R through the feet and into the plinths clockwise with the Allen key. Step 10. Attach the feet 11 to the base 10 by screwing the director screws K through the base and into the feet clockwise with the Allen key. Step 11. Slide the bearing runner bracket flush to the end of the runner. Then locate the drawers assembled in the bearing runner drawer assembly video and insert them into the unit by sliding the bearing runners into each other until you hear a clicking sound indicating that the drawer is secure.